Should we shout in faith? When we were building this building, uh, it was in the recession of 2009. And we had commitments and we had money in the bank and we had a bank loan to make up the rest, which we paid off years ago. But the bank wanted us to get another loan for $20 million to cover just in case the commitments that were, some of the commitments that were made, we had commitments for 45 million, but just in case some of them didn't come in because of the economy, we didn't know what was gonna happen. And we didn't know where else to go. And I went to the shore of Grapevine Lake and I prayed. And I said, God, what do we do? You know, what, what do we do? And I just felt like God reminded me this, shout. And I started shouting, thank you, God. Thank you, God. I just started shouting. I don't know how long I shouted, but when I started my vehicle up to leave, I got a phone call on my cell phone, and one of our members said, Pastor Robert, my wife and I were praying, how much money do you need? You mentioned the congregation, we have to borrow some more to be able to cover it, which again, we paid that off very quickly too, but we have to borrow some more, how much do you need? And I said, $20 million. The person on the phone was Marcus Lamb. And he said, Daystar would like to loan Gateway Church that money. It was after I shouted and God spoke, go ahead and rejoice now. Rejoice in faith. 